Shopify down theme product page customization tutorial. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can customize your own product page theme. This is a step by step tutorial so you can get used to this and create or customize your own uh, theme on Shopify. Uh, here I want to add a product so uh, this is just a test, okay, to uh, to make you know how to add a product. I am using this AI tool helper. I can upload a image. Uh, I am uploading this and adding this product so you can see it in real time on the online store. Here I am going to uh, fix the price, track the quantity here, nothing uh, important here. Uh, now all I have to do is to uh, save the product and then we can go to uh, online store. Then we will get right to the point. Okay, I think I have set everything in this page. Right. I have saved this. Now you can see this is set up. Now we have three products. Now we go to online store. Here, themes. We have here a gallery with free and paid themes. You can choose one of them. You can visit the theme store or you can choose one of these uh, five themes. Uh, here we click on customize. This is our topic for today. We, ha we will teach you how to customize your theme. This is the uh, stock theme. You can see here the banner is random. Uh, now the product that we have here I have three products here is the uh, editor Shopify editor this is not a drag-and-drop editor but it is a uh, action maker editor you can for example uh, here you can see the uh, different buttons different sections uh, from template uh, header the header you can the announcement bar you can change here is the subscription plan everything you click on is uh, will be checked here on the left side this is a uh, sidebar containing the information about the uh, widgets that you are clicking on them and you can of course modify them or edit them if you are uh, writing something it will uh, change of course now here you can add the media of course uh, choose a color scheme for example let's change this sc color scheme one or maybe not maybe later here this is a presentation of this sidebar you can enable sticky content on desktop uh, there is a lot of options that you can choose please take your time uh, making uh, changes on your store because because your store is the uh, mirror of your products if a store is well organized and well made the clients will be attracted to it and if not they will be avoiding it so they will take up to five six seconds and they will quit now all all i need you to do guys is to uh, take your time learn uh, exactly what you are going to do here and how to customize properly your store for like this for example you can add a logo here you can have everything from product information 
for example uh, you can uh, place it on the right or leave it on the left you can image image zoom you can click and hover uh, so if I click the zoom will go in uh, you can make no zoom of course now for uh, you have the mobile layout here you have two colon high thumbnails uh, here there are a lot of options everything is customizable on your store even any color any text any banner any widget you can choose whatever you want you can fully customize them you can change the color the fonts you can change the position of your photo or a, a position of a banner of course as i told you take your time and uh, invest in your store you have a store and you have to uh, know how to properly edit it or customize it now uh, we have here uh, uh, the I think uh, I don't know about the color but you can uh, here create template for your product you can name it for example I will name it Jack Smith I will create the template here it will be like this you can change the color I know it is very ugly I know you can change it you can uh, see the preview here are the template and the product information the header the announcement bar the price the title the text you can see it is very uh, simple not complicated at first it will be complicated to see a lot of banners and a lot of words here the description but it is very simple when you get used to it here you can and uh, hide uh, any anything to see what it will looks like without for example a title or a price here is the price I just clicked on the price and it is highlighted like this no why, why the colors is gone funny here the quantity for of course now you can see the editing scheme 5 for example you can change the color of the background as you can see you can make it white green or whatever you want of course if you have a color code specific color code you can put it uh, for me I'm just uh, playing around with colors now uh, you have the typography layout media buttons and animations for example the typography here the colors this is some basic some basics that you can edit and spend some time of course when I say spend some time learning just learn the important thing that you need don't waste your time on for example uh, uh, on the typography or on the uh, on the logo or variants like this you just need to learn the essentials because uh, this store contain landing pages and the landed, landing pages must be clean uh, well designed and of course uh, they need to be light and not very uh, saturated here for example let's see here uh, uh, I can add a product of course this is from scratch uh, then I all I have to do is uh, make some light information a light photo not a saturated photo and of course I want my clients to uh, rush on the add to cart or buy now uh, button not uh, seen around and then quitting like this I think uh, that's all for today's video thank you guys for watching and see you on the next one hope you guys 
uh, you enjoyed the video don't forget to like subscribe and leave a comment if you have a question or something peace